Because that's a deep. Yeah, it's a deep one up there, huh? A little deep. You got a small tip on there, right? Yeah, we got it cut small. Yeah. So, we want to try to fill this void in this gap here where the window didn't meet the sill at the top there, or at the top of the rock. Tighter that bead, the better. Right. Man, we got a little gap, more so. The gap varies here, so we have to put it on and wipe it down here. It looks better than it was. And depending how much caulking you have to put on there, I mean, yeah. you might decide that when you get all done, if you're not happy with it, you could cut in that edge. You could cut in the right edge. Right down to the window. Or on the drywall, exactly. You know, if you want to do that, or take your damp mm -hmm. rag, mm -hmm. wipe off any excess you happen to see. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know, or damp sponge, whatever. Yeah, you exactly. Got. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's one thing you can have a couple rags with you. And Cleaned off, fix towel, get the excess off. I think it's uh, looking better. Why not? <clears throat> yeah, why not just kind of do it? This side here looks pretty good. The top, like we had said, it's got a bigger little gap here on the top. So maybe we'll put just a little bit more and smooth it off so we can try to close in that. Look a little better there, see? Yeah, right right in there. Right and there. Uh, because it's some areas are a little bit more. And then, you know, the shutters are going to come in here. So if the top is real ragged, just try to get it the best you can and wipe it off. And generally focus in on the sides of the uh, windows here too. And... Uh, yeah, if your windows have mini blinds or shutters yeah, the or... the top's not real critical, but you want to get it sealed something off. Something like that. Yeah, you want to get it sealed still. He's got a little paper towel there. He wipes off the excess. And I see you wipe your finger. You kind of lick your finger too. Oh, well, yeah. Just get it damp wet. It. You yeah, just damp probably, it a little. Yeah, yeah. It's still probably not a good practice to lick it because... <laughs> I, I've done that. Yeah, yeah, like, I do it a few yeah, times. You start tasting cocking after Tasting's a while. Cocky. You, yeah. you want another one of them cookies. <laughs> so anyway, but it will be. You just <laughs> kind of go down. And like like we know that the windows are not uniformly uh, squared off here. But as you're seeing, as I come down here with a bead of caulking, it leaves a nice, clean finish. And then take your rag, if you got any excess that happened to get on okay. you can feel it yeah and your hand your finger will glide right along the edge here and another another process that another solution they make a colored caulking like a bone an antique and sometimes people use that and you don't have to touch up the paint if there's a gap or something